And yet again we sit, we stand at the precipice of madness and despair as our five uh, investigators of dubious <laughs> nature. I'm too tired for this intro. Well, like, oh my you, you god. Can say the, you can say yeah, the real thing. You can say that we're doing drugs. It's fine. None of us are judging. Please introduce yourselves in any order you wish. Alright. <laughs> hey, I play Thomas. I'm Randy. Let's get this started. Hey, hey I'm, I'm Dark. I my character oh, is Casey. <laughs> Never mind. I, I, I just had to. <laughs> Your turn. Go ahead. Okay. Hey, I'm for you. My name is Bob. I do Bob things. That's all you need to know. Now down one Kermit. Wait, what? You let him go into an air vent. He'll be back oh, in yeah. a minute. Yeah, no, he's, he's fine. He'll be back. Yeah, surely. If he doesn't, you I'm going to kill his relatives. Next. Your turn, Neon. <laughs> well, it always goes last. <laughs> Not always. I've been going first the past couple of times. Yeah, I'm playing Don. I'm Neon. Okay. And and I am Floyd, the doctor, played by Fluffy Artist. And as oh. the clock strikes midnight, these five are now in their hotel room. In the hotel where they believe that a cult is operating. Led, perhaps, by their erstwhile nemesis of sorts of a cigar vendor named Elmsworth. I thought you were going to say Mickey Mouse. Oh, I was actually scared for a second. <laughs> no. Hold on a second. Although Hold on I... a second, Dungeon Master. Uh, Aren't you going to Mickey introduce Mouse. our special listener today? <clears throat> oh, sorry. I forgot the birthday boy. Um, mm -mm. Yeah, we, we have special guest Trace, although perhaps he will not be the only special guest coming. Oh, it's wow. your birthday, Trace? No, it's not. No, it's no, no, I just no. said that for it's sillies. I don't know why. Oh, my <laughs> Your birthday's not until May. Mm. Well, I didn't know that. So, no, I know, don't I exist. know. So as Wait, we... what day in May? Out of curiosity. Ah, 27th. So no. as, as we resume our story, you five know that it is now about midnight. Things have fallen silent outside your room. It is dark. You know that most people will be in their rooms, and from what Dawn saw, not a lot of people were staying out. What do you wish to do? Well, we are reconvening into our rooms, are we not? Because we all have gathered what we uh, needed to see. I have said that you are already there. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, we, uh... We... Are you know we've just relayed our information to each other, mm -hmm. and I feel like at that moment we should hear we should be hearing something in the vents, should we not? Are you listening? Well, I say uh, I'm going to try listen. I'm you listen may listen. We may listen. Oh boy. Let's let let's 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 listen. I'm not on my skills page. That is not good. <laughs> <laughs> we. Um, Where's my listen? Oh, Wee. God. I'll listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The silence is deafening for you, Floyd. Oh, boy. <laughs> we do not have very perceptive ears tonight. Why? Uh, okay, it's been a long okay. Day. I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this once. <laughs> While we are in session, there we go. Oh! Holy shit! <laughs> I know, I'm for nice. you rolled that my voice. That very sense. nice. That you sense. rolled that at. Ho that's a one. Okay. Um. You know what? That makes sense. It is. It is. It is. Uh, Kermit. The frog that senses are, are tingling. For, so. Hey, uh, Fu, you my rolled. Frog that, tingling. Fu, you roll that again at regular difficulty. Oh my god! You rolled that at hard. Yeah. <laughs> You did not. Oh well, that's good for you. What you mean? Because uh, you get to improve that skill later. No, you, you get to improve it right now. Yeah, you immediately oh, gain true. five points in listen skill, raising it to fifty nine percent. Oh yeah, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give me something. Okay, so Fuyu, what you hear isn't exactly what you're listening for. You hear someone muttering to themselves in the hallway outside. Oh. All right. 
Let's do this. Oh, they're gonna fuck off. Maybe I should. Maybe I should be listening to this. Let's go. <laughs> that, that's that's what that is what you hear. So. Just sounds like someone's trying to psych <clears throat> himself up for something they are really nervous about. Employee okay, I relay you. the. Okay, I uh, I relayed this info to everyone else, being like, "Yo, guys, I'm hearing some creepy guy muttering about doing something." <laughs> Do you think he's gonna fuck someone? <laughs> mm, maybe not yeah. what you're, you're suggesting, but maybe he is trying to look for someone who may not be in their room. Or maybe he's checking in on one of the girls. I don't know. I've got a bad feeling. You've heard that? Uh, you, you actually kind of heard it a little bit through the... It was very, very faint. So nobody else has heard even a trace of this. What do you wish to do? Can you give us a description of the room? Please. Yeah, uh, that would be your, nice. Your room has uh, two large beds with bedding space for four people and, uh, and has a small bathroom uh, inside of it. There is a desk and chair with a lamp. Uh, there is also side tables for each of the two beds with lamps on those. Uh, there is a window looking outside onto a night sky of a city street. Uh, there is a waste paper. Uh, there's a waste bin in the in the corner. Uh, what floor are we on? You are on the third floor. Okay. Is there anything in the waste basket? Wait, you you want to search the waste basket? Okay, to be fair, I don't doubt randy's for thinking that honestly if you want to check check uh it is good to search every bit to see if we can find something to use to our advantage but i also think someone should also be checking the window so who's got a good um what seal should we use for this you mean spot hidden S combine spot hidden and luck mm. for the window yeah for for okay. for the waste paper I basket if you're one on spot hidden. oh okay, okay. Okay, uh, what about uh, for the sure. window? Sure. Uh, if you want to look okay, out the window so with a spot hidden. Who... Okay, so as someone who has worked as a housekeeper in a hotel, it is standard procedure to always take out the trash uh, when you are cleaning a room. So it would just be an empty basket with a bag. Indeed, it is an empty basket. All right, I'm going to check out... Oh. Thomas, have you checked out the window, or are you checking the wastebasket? He ch yeah. he said he was checking the wastebasket. I rolled what you told me to. Yep, you uh, you I failed don't... the link test. You find okay. a, an empty... You search it far and wide for every little speck possible that you might find something, but no, there's nothing there. Alright. Okay, is there a vent in this room? Right. Indeed like, there is. Yeah. It's well, the you one know, that... We put... oh, yeah, that, that's what I was listening it's... out for, right? <laughs> So when okay. we put Kermit okay. in. Uh, Bob, what is your spot hidden? 51. Alright, I say you check the vent and I'll check out- I'll check the window. <sighs> I, I, I will say that uh, you don't even need to roll. You can see everything in the vent and that it turns to the right and that you can't see anything beyond that. There's nothing uh, there. Like, okay, so what kind of vent is it? I know you said that we can look through it, but like, uh, it's an air is vent. It like one of, what? Yeah, no, no, I, I mean, what? like, as in, like, what? is it like uh, easy to like open and look inside from there, or do you mean uh, like it's sealed shut, but we can look through the grating? You, you opened it to let curtain Kermit in there, but there's just nothing there. Oh, yeah. You can't fit into mm. it, and you can't see beyond the 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 right turn in it. There's nothing there. Yeah. But Floyd has rolled an extreme success, so they, they can check their spot hidden if they haven't already. Uh, it's already checked. You spot something! You spot a robed man going into woods outside. Wait, what? Okay, okay. okay. So they're going out to the woods. Uh... One singular person in black robes. You catch a... <laughs> You, daddy, <laughs> you 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 catch a glimmer. It, it's very it's it's very quick. Uh, by by the time you would be able to like let anybody else know what you've seen, they've already disappeared into the tree line. So you're saying they went ah? 
<laughs> you, you caught them entering there. You had enough time to see them to recognize what you were seeing, but not really enough time to react to it before they were gone. Escape room skills time. <laughs> Alright, so I saw somebody out there. Um, going into the tree line. Going to a tree line, and I'm relaying this to the others. Mm -hmm. You are all informed uh, that Floyd has seen a roped person going uh, into the woods outside the back of the hotel area. Does our door have a peephole? Uh, well, it should. It does. Oh, Can I look through the peephole? Since uh, we apparently heard somebody out there. Well, well you've heard somebody. All right. Yeah, I, I heard someone. You can look at it, going, and I'm going to make a roll on my end. Uh, Dark, did you? Were you about to say something? Thirty-two. What is? Uh, no. Okay. Or at least, if I was, I have no idea what it was anymore. <laughs> uh, yep, that's a pass. You see nothing. You see, like, the hallway. Alright. But you've, you've heard someone's voice, as well as being informed that somebody has gone into the woods. What do you wish to do on this information? Well, I think we've uh, thoroughly explored this room. Unless you want to go fishing in the toilet, you sure have. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so... Is it, is it, uh, what time is it, did you say, Hex? It's midnight. 12 a.m. Night. All right. Night one. No, no, first no, night. No, 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 no. If I didn't want to say the first, first night, night, why would why I, would I say, say any more than, more than five? five? Why, why would, would I, I say, say any more, more than, than two? Than Hello. Two? Hello. <laughs> oh my god. All I know is that I'm currently <laughs> eating the lampshades. <laughs> For anyone wondering what I'm Bob's doing, I'm Ert. So I'm so with the lampshade. So what, ask why. so what are you guys doing on this information? Dark, any idea? I don't want to come up with... I don't want to be, like, directing too much in this. Hmm. Should we leave the room at all? <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's well, I guess why. Wait, wait, what time is it at? at what, what time is it's it? It's 12 right? a.m. It's midnight for the third midnight, time. Oh. Not for the we, time. Sorry, I'm just we're all like that. frantically oh. looking at the clock. I I am frantically looking at my plot lines, <laughs> waiting for things to happen. An hour ago. I think our best bet is honestly is probably to try and sneak out to the woods to figure to see what's happening. Yeah, uh, I so agree. I would say I would say the people that are best at stealth should try going to the woods while the others uh, should kind of, uh, sneak around the, uh, uh, sneak around the hotel. I vote that, that Neon and Fuyu stay what? in the room. Neon because of the <laughs> bout of insanity that might happen. And Fuyu uh, in, yeah, case, yeah. in case, uh, Kermit comes back and, uh, they need to, you know, Make sure that the hotel staff doesn't find Kermit before they make frog legs in the morning. So the only two people that Elmsworth does not know should stay and do nothing. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm the animal wrangler. You like, know what? Know you know what? Yeah. That's the uh, point. Plus, I'm, I'm good at distractions, so like, wait, if wait, someone tries wait, to go into the room wait, and question about uh, I'm, I'm, like, I, I, I'm too nice of wait, a DM. Wait, wait. I, do have a, I do have another idea. Yes? Randy, would you be okay staying behind and making sure that Neon is all right? Mm, all right. Fuyu, I am giving sure. you full gremlin privileges. I want you to sneak around this hotel. I think Fuyu right. has a higher stealth than me anyways. Well, what's your stealth at? So. 30. Ah, uh, 43, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm at 42. I think I have the lowest stealth. What's your stealth? 20. <laughs> yeah, I got, I got a bit of stealth, actually. Uh, Trace wants to know what the name of the town is. Uh, it's Boston. <laughs> Boston. 
Boston. Okay, but we, we need to like we are nice it's a Boston area. area. Boston. Okay, so we need to sort of like organize it a wee bit more. Like I reckon, like we should. So, what are the points of interest besides you know going to the woods to find the creepy uh, so, hooded guy? So there's the door that Dawn saw people going into, uh, that was guarded yesterday or before. No, no, no. But he has informed you that it is no longer being guarded as it was before. Gremlin privileges go. And that he saw people, <laughs> he saw the hotel staff and the owner that you guys got your room key from going into that room. Okay, and anywhere else to investigate if we're going to separate? Uh, you know, I'm just probably the, probably the staff areas. Like yeah. behind the counter, behind the front counter, maybe. Uh, okay. Or that place I found. Okay, so if we're going to be searching those areas, I'll take outside and I'm going to take a gun, take my gun with me. Are you going out the door? Oh no, I'm sneaking out. You're sneaking out of the door. Okay. I don't stealth. want any of this stuff to. <laughs> oh. Oh. You open the door. It makes a loud opening sound. It seems that people have not really applied much oil to those hinges. There is somebody in the hall. There is an individual in the hall. They are robed. Uh. Wait, what? There's no. Wait, hold on. There's another robed person in the hallway? And I need to. I'm going to just shut the door on their face. They see you. <laughs> no. You no. that door was loud. They see it. No, I'm just gonna be like, nope. Blame the door. Fuck this shit I'm out. Pretty much. <laughs> Next time I'm going through the Uh I will I will I will describe because you do get a glimpse of this person. The individual before you is clad in an old-fashioned robe with, a, with the cowl raised. He appears to be a young man in his early 20s, his skin light and sleek, and his hair a true blonde. He wears glasses, through which his eyes are blue and focused, and are now narrowed into a glare at you as you open the door quite unstealthily. Wait a minute. Uh, in... Wait, in can minute. I just yell nerd to him really quickly before, she, before in, they slam the door on him? In... <laughs> In one hand, he holds onto a cane, whilst in his other hand, he quickly puts a book into a bag. Oh, you sneaky son Ooh. of a gun. I know who this is. Huh? You do? Yeah. Uh, you know what? Uh, Randy, <coughs> let, let, let's board up this door, because I don't feel safe. <laughs> nope. What are you going to board it up with? <laughs> I'm gonna put yeah. the beds in front. We're up with wait, neon. Wait, wait. <laughs> barricade. Find neon on. against the yes, door. Thank you, thank you. I knew it was a B word. Thank you, neon barricade. <laughs> nope, <Bitch>. nope. <laughs> I say we work about. We worry about this tomorrow then. Oh, I hate that so much. I hate that. This is gonna be. Oh, I'm gonna take a drink. Oh, gee. <sighs> okay. So you're just shutting the door? Mm. <laughs> Is that it? Yep. Okay, I'm you like, shut uh -huh. the door. I, I turn Nothing happens. I'm turning to KC. Grab your gun. Meanwhile, I still eat some lampshades while no one's looking. You might Ooh. want to grab your gun. I feel mm -hmm. like, uh, feel like we have a target on our back now, thanks to these stupid Listen buttons. rolls from each of you. Oh, yeah. Uh, Another one. Sense. Another one. Wait, is it oh, regular rolls? Oh, God, no! <laughs> Look at that. Ooh, Let's you see. heard... Uh, Jesus, guys. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. At least Wait, one no, of you listen, has to pass. Guys, listen, listen, come on. What? Everybody's least... got a roll. Everyone li do a listen roll. Everybody do a barrel roll. 
You know, you know what? Since we are all failing this, I'm going to try to push it by putting my head against the door. Is that oh, good? No. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. Oh no. You slam your head against the door. <laughs> uh, <laughs> What is what my, is with World Twenty today? You do oh, my, it's never this bad. You do you do indeed stumble as you as you go towards the door and you knock your head against it. <laughs> it's loud. Mine is great for a session to watch. Oh, Wait. I hate that. This, I'm a, I, if, if about, we end up still doing bad, about Don? Uh, Don rolled a failure. The only person who has not rolled is Dark. Uh, Dark, please roll. Please save us. Uh, what do you want me to roll again? Listen. listen. Oh, thank God, one of us was saved. Check your listen. <laughs> you you see you see Floyd ordering like the door to be barred up, uh, but you hear something that doesn't really make you feel like that's a necessity. You hear mm -hmm. footsteps heading away from the door. You hear somebody walking down the stairs, the stairway down. Uh, oh, I think, so. Uh, I think that what wherever they want to go is not towards us. Now I fly All right. Okay, so you're saying they went away. Got it. Why don't we uh? Why don't we try to do this tomorrow then? Um, Kaya, did you bring anything for maintenance on your gun for any chance? Like any of your equipment? Oh. Yeah, obviously. So I say tomorrow, since we just got these these guys that just left. Tomorrow we we just uh, who's man? Will you turn your video off, please? Perhaps probably not. Neon. Perhaps probably not. Perhaps probably not. Weird. Anyway, um, so how about tomorrow? When the sus when uh when we don't have as much you know suspicion on our back because we open the door, like a bunch of animals, <laughs> and I'm saying that to myself. When we don't have um, as much suspicion. When you're okay. Okay. Yeah, really, we, can, yeah. we can uh, I, we could probably I like, I don't know, put some WD forty on that shit. Like I get what you mean, but at the same time, it's very risky to do that. Cause think of it: if we if we just leave it until the morning, that mm -hmm. means the rogue guys will be going to their boss, being like, "Yo, so a couple of fucks in this room uh, open their door. Should we kill them? Eh, fuck it, and then they'll kill us all. So maybe we should try to do something tonight. Oh. I mean, no, I'm. Tr that's why I'm trying. I am trying to get ideas, cause I'm not trying to be the only one. You can roll idea rolls. Can people I mean, yeah, it, for you. like at at this point we're kind of like at a at a point of all or nothing so we're either we either got to go for it now or we don't or we're not going to be able to do it ever so all right well uh kaya could you please put whatever you use to for the gears of your gun um on the door yeah and so kaya is just gonna uh She's just gonna kind of uh, fish around in her bag a little bit, mm -hmm. and then uh, put the the oil just like drop it down the hinges. Okay. Like, pour it on top so that it drips down it. Mm hmm. You've done that. All right. So, um, I guess same plan as last time. Thomas, you should stay with Dawn. Will you? Why don't you? Um, you look around. See if you can find Kermit. See if he's got anything to report. Okay. I just open the vent and go, RIP IT! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, I'm going uh, to make a roll for that. <laughs> oh, please. Okay, what roll do I got? Okay, sure no, no, I'm rolling this. Oh, boy. Kaya, please make sure you have your gun on you. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, I always, I pretty much what always What is this person's gun? skill in? Okay. <laughs> You yell for Kermit. You get no nah, response. I, ju I just say, I just say Kermit. That's all I yell. You get no response. Do it in a Miss Piggy voice. Nary a no, peep yeah. nor a croak.
<laughs> okay, not gonna lie, for a second there, I thought you were gonna be like, and then a bunch of rogue people came out of nowhere because they heard the commotion going, what the fuck's going on? Well, if they were, you wouldn't know that. <laughs> All right. So, um, okay, Kaya, uh, Rosalind, you're both with me uh, for now. Let's go. Uh, oh, wait. Okay, do we still have a flashlight on us? Does one of us have a flashlight? Uh, yes. I believe you I all got yourselves flashlights. Okay. Uh, Thomas, if we, if if you encounter something, or if you see something from the window, uh, flash your flashlight outside so that one of us can see it. Alright. And we'll do the same if we need to get your, get your, uh, attention. Just keep an eye on the window, keep an eye on Dawn. So we're going to grab, right. like, our, our gear. Oh. Hmm. Does anyone... Who here knows Morse code? Uh, I know SOS. That dot 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 dash 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 Y'all are dot, so dot. methodical. What? I know how to speak animal. I can go ribbit. 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 We'll see how splitting up in a horror thing goes. That was me! <sighs> Apparently, I scared my dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, well, I'm gonna grab the chair by the desk and sit over by the window. Okay. Make sure Dawn is tightly, tightly, tightly tucked into bed. <laughs> All right. Well, all right. Uh, gets my rope out. Uh, hmm. How come, come I'm more seems to be more sane than Dawn? <laughs> Why is that the new meta now? Let's let's. All right, let's, let's go. Let's go. We're gonna just we're going, man. We're going. Okay. So you guys are walking out the door. Nobody's in the hallway. All right. Well, no one's in the hallway. It start sneaking towards where we need to go. All right. Are all of you sneaking? Yes. <laughs> then that's gonna be a stealth roll for each of you. Okay. Oh boy. Yay! Alright, check stealth. It's a yep. pass from Rosalyn. It's a failure from Kaya. This is me we're talking about, is it really that surprising? So you two are are sneaking along. And uh You got you guys actually make it down to the to the second floor. And then you you get to the stairs from from the first floor, and you see, uh, Floyd, you see the same man you saw looking around in the lobby. Unfortunately, before you can stop your compatriots, Kaya steps on a particularly squeaky stair tile. <laughs> or a stair floorboard. Squeak. <laughs> <laughs> and you have alerted the man once again. <laughs> Damn, guys. Come on now. He turns to face you. <laughs> And can he see, as can as he see as Kaya as or can he see him. all of us? He sees all three of you. You you are like halfway just, down the stairs to the second floor, and he is standing in the middle of the lobby. Laugh from his room. And I will once again read this man's description. Uh, the individual before you is clad in an old-fashioned robe with the cowl raised. He appears to be a young man in his early 20s, his skin light and sleek, and his hair a true blonde. He wears glasses, uh, through which his eyes are blue and focused, and are now narrowed into a glare at you as you enter the hallway. In one hand, he holds onto a cane, whilst in his other hand, he has nothing, because he's already put that away. Yeah. Okay, I, I real quick, I just want to point He's out that up. the way you say that may it sound like we were in a dating show for a second. <laughs> the person you see before you is all clad with his beautiful blue eyes, all oh, with his cane. That's a pimp. <laughs> <laughs> who are you? It's, it's Lucius Malfoy. You're none of And who are you? That's none of your concern. Why are you out of your room? So you like you got Did lost we or something. Do you feel like you... We are trying to retrieve something that my dear friend here, and I pat Rosalind on the hat, head, lightly, seems to have dropped earlier. I didn't want to make a fuss, but you scared the shit out of me earlier. Would you be so kind as to let us just look in the lobby for a moment to see if we can find the lost item? 
I'm afraid I cannot do that. You should return but to your rooms. My, I got my pencil, though! My pencil's special to me! You see the distress in this young lass? <laughs> I pretend to really blow my eyes this, out. He, do you really <laughs> want this in your hotel at this late at night? Or do you just want to let us get, get the item in? I would like that back in whatever room you came from. Is that any way to talk to your guest here? He slams his cane on the ground, and it becomes a trident. You, think you will know. return to your rooms now. Oh, so shit. throughout that exchange, can Casey just kind of have been slowly backing up? You can. The encounter still goes the way it has been described. Yep. Casey's just going to keep <laughs> slowly backing up until she's out of sight. Casey, you you're a, you're you you might be a bit astonished by the way that that thing just extended from a cane into a trident. That's a uh, that's quite a feat of uh of uh, yeah, no, engineering. The second, she, the second she says she sees that, she's just like, "Oh, that's impressive." Oh my! Is that trident in your pocket, or you're just happy to see? Oh my it? god! What is your response? Listen, we don't want trouble. We just want to get what we left in the lobby. But if you're going to make a big fuss, then we'll return. But do you uh, know okay. that I am going to be talking to your boss about this in the morning. Okay, real right. quick, Fluffy. I think this guy's beyond reason because he literally right. whipped out a trident. <laughs> <laughs> a literal <laughs> trident. I, I think you're, blown. I don't you're think going to need a... Boss. Unnerved. You're going to need a social skill here, and it's not going to be an easy roll. Uh, what's a social skill? Uh, you could try to charm him. You could try to intimidate him. You could try to fast talk him. Or you could try to persuade him at a hard difficulty. I got 15. All of these have to be hard? All of them would be hard. Oh, he is not inclined yeah. to do this. All right. Can I attempt to intimidate him? No, do not. Well, because we want to piss him off even more. Let me see. What <laughs> do I have? He's going to start shooting like bolts of shooting. magic out no, of that. He's... Right. <laughs> well, yeah, I know. He could be just a crazy God, old man with a to try to psychoanalyze yeah. this guy, but. That will not work. Hmm. Can someone tell me what fast talk does? I, I it's don't actually... pretty much deception. You're it's basically like blagging your way. Yeah. You basically go. Uh, 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 for a brief moment. Uh, no, you're like, yeah, I'm like the best man. Like, you don't even know. Like, super awesome. <laughs> <laughs> or you just so go, eh, hey, super trident. I'm actually going to do something really dumb here. She's going to kind of like, like, kind of dash over to where he is with the trident and kind of just start. Start like kind of inspecting it, like oh, uh, hey, how Casey, how about no? Because he's going to shoot. You're gonna, gonna, gonna get it. forked. No, Casey, no, please, no, do not. You're rushing. You, grab, like, you, you, are, like you are. You are. You are no. rush. You're rushing over nope. to him. No. This is Casey's decision. Oh boy. And is we it, are is... telling them no. I'm just asking. Is that is that what you want to do? Okay, let them get impaled. <laughs> uh, I oh want it will be the right uh, impale, she's gonna, but it'll she's be gonna kind a of impalement. like rush to the bottom of the steps and then be like can I see that can I check that out no can all I three of you need to make immediate reactions oh my god because uh, like it all of you are going to be choosing whether you're doing nothing or dodging yeah uh. Uh, I was uh, trying to make a roll, but now I gotta dodge. I'm gonna follow the way of oh. Casey. God damn it. Why, Casey? Casey! <laughs> Casey's great, we love them. Why can not you let me at least try the hard roll before you start in this sh This is going great. <laughs> this is... <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even in the room yet. We're all gonna die tonight. <laughs> oh boy! All of you clumsily dive toward the bottom of the stairs, uh, getting uh, a bit of a. I'm already at the bottom. Uh, yeah, you dive to the ground. The other two kind of get like 
soar as they land. As this man, with remarkable speed, draws back his trident and throws it at you. Thankfully, thankfully, either he wasn't aiming for you, or this was a terrible throw. And it sinks into the stair wood with a loud and metallic ting! And he starts running. How far away from... How far away from... Alright, I'm pulling out my gun. You... Uh, we're gonna be doing a chase scene now. He's running away, and you have all dived for cover. Oh, if we... If he's running away and we dive for cover, I'm picking up his trident. Okay. Wait, before we do that, can we at least... Can one of us at least examine the trident before any of us touch it, just in case? Because I get the feeling you'll have bad juju. And it's gonna be like freaking All right, the black what's the role for inspecting it? From Aquaman Last Kingdom. No, no, no. What's this the role is... for inspecting it? This is a chase scene. So let's see here. I need to get to my section. I think we're learning to so They're you. not chasing him anymore. They just want to look at the trident he just throw. Oh, yeah, I'm they're... gonna. I'm gonna need another drink. I'm sorry, it's <laughs> funny. This is a chase scene. Meanwhile, the meanwhile the players. Ooh, trident. <laughs> well, I just, okay. Uh, who's gonna, okay, who's gonna? Okay, I'm gonna go chase after the guy. Who? Who's the one? Yeah, Bob, you go chase. Trident? All right, I'm okay. <laughs> I'm I, I... Hey, shouldn't the one with some kind of like mechanical knowledge well, be the um, one to check it so out? I'm gonna say I this am... man has plus two to his move status on the first uh, on the first initial like chase setup. Because you all have dived on to, onto the floor, so you're going to need to pick yourself off the floor before you even start running if you want to chase after him. Oh, I'm uh, gonna... Wait, wait, what, so what, that what do we put, need to do? That puts him at move nine. Are any of you move nine or higher? Well, where's move? Wait, how do we, wait yeah, where, where do we check that? It is on, it should be on your character sheet. Let's see. Uh, on your PDF character sheet. I don't, I don't know if that made yeah. its way. Yeah, oh. no, it, Wait, it, what? it's on our it's on our actual character sheet. All right, where? Let's see. What, what, yeah, where is it? Uh, Combat. Yeah, Movement probably. Great nine. So you have move nine. Uh, nine. Ah, uh, I got eight. Fuyu cannot possibly react fast enough. All right, I'll go after it. Casey gets to see the cool trident. <laughs> <laughs> so the first thing we're gonna but, do. Um. Let's not, not to put pressure on Casey. I just want to point out it's all on you. <laughs> yeah, Casey. How about we don't try to look at the fancy fancy footwork next time, and we just not try to antagonize the guy that's pointing us pointing a trident at us. He's running. Actually, tag. Blame oh. Blur for getting him mad earlier by opening the door. Yeah, he's running away. So you guys are choosing anyway. whether you're chasing him or not. I'm chasing him. Dark, are you chasing? But I've got my nope. gun still. Trident. Okay. Casey's more interested in the trident. And Bob, why don't you go trident. ahead and just go explore since they're distract since he's distracted. Okay. So uh okay. Uh Floyd, I need you to make a con roll. You are doing it opposed to this man. That's failure. Uh let's see. What is his? You know what? I think I'm not going to be the one to stream this. Someone else can stream it. My rolls are sucking. I thought the point of streaming it was so that I could see. Yeah, I know, but you're watching and no one's failing. Oh, look at that's, that. That guy that's freaking... that, that's yeah. a hard success. He's uh, freaking flash. He's gone. So you have minus one move rating for the duration of this chase. I hate this. I really hate this Here's right now. Something. You have no chance of catching him. He is too fast. Can I throw something at him? Uh, no. He is actually too- by the time Wait. you're up to his feet, he's out of the Lovely. building. Lovely. Just wonderful. That's as fuck, boy. Shut. Dark! Shut. Dark. <laughs> Are you- you're examining the trident. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna first- I'm gonna take a second and get another drink. I'll be right back. The first thing you can do on the uh, what? Well, tell me how you're inspecting it. Well, first, uh, first thing she's gonna do is she's going to uh, to kind of like look uh, to see if there is 
uh, a way to retract the uh, the trident points to see like where that is. Uh, you see a, a small little latch on the actual staff part of it. All right. Uh, Casey is going to inspect that mm -hmm. uh, to see if that is what leads to the uh, the My dark beverage and that uh, oh. releases the prongs. Okay. Oh. Uh, you do that, and indeed it does, and it latches together with remarkable speed. You uh, you have to you you kind of move your Fingers back a little bit of an, in anticipation. But uh, that's not the only way it's moving. It's... Uh, are you holding on to it after you do that? Uh, no, she would kind of like, uh, like press it, kind of like expecting it to sort of like fall over once, the, once it wasn't lodged in the ground anymore. Uh, so you pull... As you're pulling it out of the ground, it mm. starts racing towards one of the corners of the walls of the room. Well, no, she she wasn't pulling on it. She was like, it's like stuck in the it, floor, right? It's it's you've pulled it out, and now it's moving in ways that you aren't making it move. Okay, no. Uh, okay, from my you're going to this thing. This it's thing moving is on its own. Yeah, in it's the floor, right? What yeah. I'm doing is I'm pressing like whatever mechanism is on there to see if that is what closes the trident. Oh, yeah. okay. All right. Well, you freed it, and now it's moving and flying across the room. Sanity checks for all who see it. Well, I'm out of the room, and I think Bob went somewhere else. Uh, uh I'm because I said Bob somewhere. should go. I don't have to make one. Woo! Oh no! Okay. Rosalind would see this. Not in there. So, what? What is Rosalind doing? Rosalind. Yeah, I, I was trying to roam somewhere, so I'm roaming somewhere. I don't yes, know where they went I am. to go find other things. They're not in the room. Only Kaya's in the room. Okay, then only Kaya takes a sanity check, uh, and you have failed it and lose two, as you see this thing fly from where it's set on the ground through the wall. And disappear. Ooh. Huh. <clears throat> now, when uh, you say through the wall, you mean like it yep. stays through it? Pretty much. Yeah. Okay. All right. So since I can't catch him, I'm going to just go you towards have lost the woods. Him. I'm going to go towards the woods. You go towards and the I've woods. And I've got my gun. You've got and your I'm gun. And I'm looking out the window. And I've got my flashlight, too. You, you're going towards the woods. These woods look pretty thick. Are you going to venture in there alone? Into the dark woods? I'm gonna throw a rock. You throw a rock! <laughs> uh, you hear it hit the grass. Nothing I happens. Anything. <laughs> this is reminding me of something, Hex. <laughs> You've showed me it. So I'm going to uh, I'm going to flash a light just once at the uh, at the window towards our room. Uh, you see Randy up there. Uh, you see Thomas up there sitting in a chair. Thomas, a light, light is shined in your eyes. Not in uh, the eyes. Kind of well, <laughs> yeah, up towards you. I see it. <laughs> so I can confirm that one of you at least is out there. Mm hmm. All right. I'm going to check the perimeter first before I, I do anything in that wood. All right. What do I roll? Uh, spot hidden. Damn. It is not liking you tonight. No, it's not. And I'm starting to get really mad. You don't like, manage I'm, to spot anything. Like, legitimately, I'm starting to get pissed off. Can I, uh... It seems that the outer perimeter of this place is quiet. Can Randy There's... see anything from hit from the window? Uh, you, you've been watching through that window and nothing has happened, except for you've seen Floyd kind of meander their way over to the edge of the woods, throw a rock in there, and then shine the light up towards your window. <laughs> so, Rosalind, you, you get to the door, and you, you try the knob, door's unlocked. 
Okay. It, it's obviously a door that's meant to be locked. Somebody's been careless, you think. Okay. You also walk past the staff area with uh, what you spot is a records book. Uh, all right. Grab yep. it, grab it, grab it. Uh, uh sure. <laughs> you grab the book. Do you have the accounting skill? What? <laughs> I got five in it, so no. Uh, well, you can try to read the what is obviously accounting records. Wait, wait, is, booking is records. Book like, uh, is the records like? Is it literally like a whole stack of pages, or is it just like it's, a book? It's the book it's at the front desk. It's okay, can I can I examine the cover of it? Uh. Yeah, it's it's the book of the Merrillson Bradley booking records. Then don't grab it. Uh what? But I was told if, to grab it. If you I thought you, it was an uh, interesting book because of the way he let off, but if it's an accountant uh, thing, then don't grab it. I mean, we could figure out like I don't know. We, we could try to like locate some of these names, see if like maybe like if you uh, want You know what? That's a you, good point. Keep it. If you want to gain okay. information from, from reading through this, you will need to roll an accounting check. I or I can steal it. it. Steal if you get I can just steal it, it. We and then we can just it give it to the detective for the police. Yeah, we, we can just steal it. You can it, give yeah. it to me. Steal I'll be accountant. Be stealing McSteel face. Grab it. All right. Yeah. You take the records okay. book. Yeah. I shove it in my sweater. So you know that the door is unlocked, and you know that there is a staff room that leads into an office. That you have not looked in. Alright. Sounds like a good place to roam. Can I quickly... Do Wait, yeah, sorry. Ne ne Neon, we'll get it to you if you have that skill. Okay, so... You're saying that, like, uh, I just see, like, a door? Uh, yep, you see you see the door that Dawn told you all about? It is unlocked. Ah. Uh, which I would you like think to listen... Would in before I do anything because I'm worried. Ooh, apparently. yes. Roll a listen check. Alright. Yeah, Good let's job. go. Good Ooh, job. check I'm that listen if you haven't. Me. You hear what sounds like very distant conversation. Very distant. That means there might be a lot of people with cloaks in there. You can't really no. tell how many voices from this distance, but it sounds like a conversation. Hmm. And the conversation reads. Uh, you, I, I you, think it you, might be a bit yeah. It, it, it's, it's difficult to make out. Yeah. But you hear voices. <laughs> All right. Will you? Can you hide? Can you see if you can hide? You haven't uh, gone no, in no. there. They're yeah, very no, 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 distant. I'm not, I'm not in the door. I, I just like, uh, I heard. I'm like. Popping like I'm I'm leaning my ear through the door to see if I can hear anything and that's why I hear I just hear like muffled conversations from a bunch of people. Like the option is to either I can take a sneak peek, however, that will probably mean I'll have to do like a cheeky uh stealth check. I do have the points for it, but it's risky because we don't know how many people are in there and they may have they sound they sound very distant, like very distant. Yeah, but like I'm worried about the cameras though. They could have cameras in there. If they're having, like, a secret cabal or you, something going on in there. This is the 1920s. Just peek. There are no cameras. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, we all good to continue? Yep. Yeah, can, okay. you, peek, can you peek over the door just a little? Just a, okay, a little okay. Uh, wait, so... Hex, you said it was unlocked. Does that mean, like, is the door, like, a bit askew? Or is it just, like, I you, know what's unlocked? You try the handle and you recognize that you are able to open it. Okay. It turns gonna... fully. For once in my life, I'm gonna quietly, like, open the door just wide enough so I can, like, look through with my eye. That's it. Just to see if, like, I can see anything. Without right. it being obvious. Go ahead. Uh, okay, so wait, what, what, uh, is it stealth? Uh, if you're trying to do it quietly, it is, or you can just look. Yes. <laughs> or I can just look. <laughs> um, However you want to do it. If you can get away with not having to roll something, why don't we just do that for right now? Yeah, because... yeah I'll, I'll just look. I'll just look. All right. I don't want to risk it. You look, you open the door, you see a stairway going down, 
and eventually bottoming out to a concrete corridor that extends beyond your field of view. Alright, so is it like one of those stairwells where it's just like, uh... It's concrete where the steps. Door... Yeah, yeah, but I mean, like, uh, is it like one of those stairwells where, like, there's not much space near the door entryway, you know what I mean? Like, there's no, yes, like, secret... it is one of like those. Nothing... Okay, okay. Okay, then... Sh okay. Should I just... Should I sneak down there, or should we... Uh, I have a suggestion. Can you make another listen roll? Okay, okay. Listen for Kermit again. I'm not I'm not moving from my position. I'm not going right. to creak it wide or open. I'm just... Since the door is slightly open with my eye, uh, I should hear conversations a wee bit better, so I yep. will see. Yeah! Good was job. Good. Uh, you still hear the voices. Uh, okay. They're not blocked by the door anymore, but they still sound very far away. Uh, okay. You do not hear Kermit. All right. Uh, is there anything else in the immediate area that you can investigate? Uh, no, the office. Room. Yeah, the office that you have. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's go. Let it, we should we should investigate that before we go anywhere. Okay, okay. I I, mm -hmm. I quietly close the door back, so I'm like doing that thing where like you know you know how like when you twist like a handle it like uh, takes but out uh, you know. By this point, enough of Fuyu's actions have been taken to where either uh, f uh, Floyd and Dark, if you guys want to rejoin with her, uh, you may have done so by now. Yeah. I'm going to meet back up with Kaya, yeah, and uh, we're going to uh, at least be in the same vicinity as Fuyu. Yep. Uh, Kaya, you notice immediately that uh, Fuyu has a records book. I okay. got the book. Kaya, do you have a satchel on you? Uh, yeah, I would. Okay, grab, uh, can you put- Hallie! <laughs> Alright, can you put that in your satchel so that it- we don't have to have Kaya- Okay, Rosalind just holding on to it, because Rosalind doesn't have a Book. satchel like we do. Now, I do have a cheeky sweater, but it's kind of stinky, so I don't know if you want it wrapped in there. Your sweater's not gonna be stinky, I washed it! <laughs> Wait, since when did you touch my shit? Since you've been living with me for like two weeks, maybe a month. <laughs> Wait, I'm living- I've been living where? <gasps> you've been living with me for like two weeks. This is news to me, I thought I was in some Ever abandoned since... apartment. Roslyn. Side story. Roslyn <laughs> has been crashing at uh, Floyd's place since you got out of Virginia. Flashback moment. Catch her home. Bruh, you got a bath. Right. Let the man so, be smelly if he wants to be so, so at this no, point... No, uh, that's, how I, that's, how I, that's how I earned uh, Don's respect at one point. At I, this... I told... <laughs> for washing me? At, at this yeah, point... you got, got hosed. At this point before you... I respect you, you for hosing food. <clears throat> Pretty much. Guys. At this point before you guys continue, I would ask if Thomas wanted to do anything beyond just sitting there. Hmm... Oh, just keeping an eye out the window and making sure Don's all right. Okay. Spot hidden roll. Ooh. Uh, I'll be right back. I'm also going to ask if Neon is looking outside that window. Yeah, Neon, you can still like can't, look out can't. the window and stuff. It's just you need some rest. Well, I don't know. Hey, we, we, we've condemned the man to, to resting, but if he's looking out the window, he can be looking out the window. Okay. Oh, Ooh! Oh no. You spot something! I don't know if it's, uh... Oh. So while you have a view of, of the woods out the back, you also have a little bit of a view of the of some building tops a while away. You see something on a far distant building top that looks very strange to you. It looks almost bird-like, but it's about, it's a really, really big bird. Its silhouette is staring directly at you. And when you blink, it's gone. Sanity check. Oh god, not this again. For both of us? Is Neon looking out the window? I don't think Neon should be looking out the window. I said this before the whole thing that Hex just said. Oh, he would be. 
Well, sanity check for both of you. Oh, my God. I don't want him looking out the window. Only I should be looking out the window. Because yep. he's going to go into a bout of madness if nope. he fails. Nope, it. he passes. Well, he's slide down this time. Nope, nope. He passes and loses no sanity. You pass and lose no sanity. But it is very Good. weird. Why can I not see his rolls on my freaking roll? Yeah, 20? I can't. Oh, wait. Oh, he rolled, hey, that, GM, he rolled uh, that GM only. I whispered that by mistake. I already turned yeah. it off. He got a 30 against 32. He succeeded. All right. All right. So Thank God. You, go, you guys, lose. do either of you have Cthulhu Mythos? Oh, freaking probably not. No. No, Where's... no. You have no idea yeah, what you my... just saw. It's an eagle. <laughs> That's a griffin. You know what? It probably was a griffin, but we won't know. It's, it's but... Big Bird. <laughs> it's but Big Bird. You... But you actually might be leaning more towards but, Harpy. <laughs> but uh, Thomas, you have the feeling that that thing, whatever it was, was looking right at you, as if it knew you were there. That's terrifying. Mm. Back to the other three. So we're going to look through the office. You look through the office. It doesn't take a long search for you to be able to see that there is another book. This one, uh, seeming to be of financial records. Why is the a diff accounting versus finances? Okay, that's all right. Well, we're gonna one put of it them in the... probably well, cracked one... the guess. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, you've got yeah. Like Fuyu that. took what looks to be like room bookings. Okay, well, we're gonna stash that in the okay. In the... So the ledger. Yeah, the ledger. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna put that in the in the damn. Okay, well. uh, we're just looking for books, man. We're look we found another book. book. It's financing. It's the ledger. Yeah, all yep. the library bandits. <laughs> You're stealing oh, all the books. Uh Dawn. Uh of course, Skyrim style. Dawn. Yes. Roll an idea roll. Uh I don't know what that is. I've got an idea. So, roll roll no against ideas. your intelligence. I failed. You failed? Uh, Why is that... You... You are getting a bit restless sitting here, doing nothing. It's not right. You should be able to do something. I mean, is... Is this really a good idea to have the group split like this? That is so out of character for me. <laughs> that is very much out of character for Don. I will admit. But you're getting it, it's it's less of that and more that you see Thomas. He he looks like his his body has seen better days. Uh and he's just staring out the window. The door is unlocked, and as from what I remember, you guys said you tied him up. What if somebody what? comes through that door? Wait, I'm is Thomas tied up? What? Is, no, I'm not yeah, we just I, I remember you. I, wait, I remember you said, "Guy, oh my god." We joked. That was a joke. No. Oh, I wasn't actually, joking. Right? I said we should tie oh, him up and use him as like a barricade for the door. Serious. Yeah, I thought you were serious. Holy shit! Okay, five seconds. Five seconds. Randy, were you serious or was that a joke? Because I took it as a joke. I'm gonna take that. That's happening. Okay. Okay. Because yeah, you guys are going on like, oh, we can't let him do anything. Yeah, and he said that jokingly. Still, you feel antsy. Dark, what do you suggest we do? Well, like I it said, my suggestion room. is to have... is to ha take the books up to Don, have him kind of go through them for what would be the most relevant. Right? Copy down those pages. Like... Like be like, uh, okay, this this page looks like it would be. This page looks like it could be important, and then like, you know, copy it down, and then like go over it. Okay, like, how about this? Bob, can later? you go grab? Can you go grab Randy and uh, and Don and just bring them over here? Okay, that's okay. Simple. You can do Please. that. You guys, you guys, you have a room visitor. It's for you. Hello, I'm breaking and entering. I, I just yes. let him in. 
despite their words. Yay, I'm breaking and entering! Now give me your money! Basically, but follow me is what they're saying. Surprise betrayal! <laughs> <laughs> I where need your the, money! Where's the fire? Wait, there's the fire? No, no, please don't say things that might confuse the flu. Betrayal! I was a cultist all along. There was fire? <laughs> oh my goodness, it's figure uh, speech. Don, you immediately notice that Fuyu is carrying two books of records for the hotel. Book. No. Hold on, hold on. No, I thought they are, had the books. They are with us. We have them in the satchel. Okay. We just sit Bob to yeah, go yeah, collect no, I, Don and... Yeah, no. Okay, Thomas. they're in the satchel. Yeah. I, gave, I gave them the books and then I went to the room. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we're all going down then? Yes. All right. All right. Uh, if, uh, if Don wants to make any accounting rolls on the two books, if, uh, if Fuyu will show them to him, you may. Two accounting the rolls. Books are, the books are down there, though, but I got you. Yes, I'm but you wait. Yeah, we're, we're all, we're well, all. I passed one. All right. Which one do you want the pass to be for? Whichever one we found first will be the first one. Second one will be the second one. I don't remember. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, Which I'm, I'm. I'm I'm letting you choose whether you succeed on the finances or the bookings. Booking. That's All right. Useful. I think the ledger should be the one that gets passed. You think the finances should be the one that gets passed? Mm-hmm. All right. I'll take this party's advice and do that one. All right. You sk you look through the financial records and you notice that there are several instances of strange purchases for the needs of a hotel business. You see purchases of things such as medical blood bags and chemical components. Interesting. Uh, interesting. You don't I... recognize any of the names, but perhaps with some chemistry skill or some medical skill. Med nope. skill. Medicine? Mm, <laughs> like, nope. No, no, medicine? I'm asking. You, you know the doctor is right there. Is it a medicine hole? <laughs> oh, yeah. Big neon sign right here. <laughs> Ding ding ding! <laughs> is it a medicine I or wonder. Or? Yeah, yeah I, I would inform the doctor if I could figure out some medicine. If these are pointed I, out I to anyone, they may roll. Yeah, I'll point it out to the doctor then. Oh no! No, what? I'm pushing it. I'm gonna read it more. I'm gonna look through my notes. I'm gonna look through this stuff I have in my bag. I'm pushing this. I'm not failing this. Okay. Please don't roll it. Oh. There we go. Let's go. Make a check on medicine. Checked it. Checked. I am. I am not happy with my rolls tonight. You notice uh, that for one, all the all the blood bags are of uh, of multiple different blood types, uh, including one that doesn't make sense. There is a blood type C on there for one of the bags. That's not right. Uh, the second thing you notice with the chemical components with your extreme success is that that's a lot of stimulant drugs. Right? Oh, they're, doing, they're doing some That's cocaine. Setup, right? Right. right? No, right. There, there, there are many different <laughs> types of... There, there are many different types of amphetamines here. That's cocaine. What kind of kinky yeah. shit are they getting up to? Oh, brother. Okay. Um, interesting. Uh, so I'm gonna say all this out loud to the party. Um, I'm going to recommend to Dawn to look at the first thing again to see if we're missing something. I'll look at the I'll, re I'll re re accounting the roll. One. You would need to no. push the roll, or no. you could spend luck to make your success on the one you succeeded better, because you will actually get more information with better successes. I don't. How much luck points would that be to get? That'll be thirteen luck points. I don't think that's worth it. Yeah, it's not worth thirteen luck points. No, he's talking about for your success. I know. So. Don't they get it down to twenty? Uh, yeah. You can you can make it a hard success with uh thirteen luck points, and you'll yeah. get yeah. more information. Not worth it. Okay. Ugh. In that case, you have gathered all you believe you can from these books. And all that's all right. left um, is the door. 
or we can go with... outside and check the check outside. Do we want to check the door? Or we want to check outside. You saw no one while you were outside. All right, let's get to the door. The Fine, we're taking the door. You walk down the door. The, carefully. The... Carefully. Uh... <coughs> Let me just roll this, I swear to God. No, you no. do not need to roll. Uh, I need to find the descriptions. Do, 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 do. All right. Oh, so we're going through the, uh, the uh, door yep. that we've been talking about. My, unless anyone objects, all of you have followed. Can I can I say something just out of out of as, is aspiration? Yes. I love how I have a skill that is like 90, 91, and I'm not going to get a chance to use it. What the skill is it? It's my well, education. Yeah, oh. Uh, uh. Well, that's that's something that gives you like skill points uh, on stuff. So you got like twenty four skill points, uh, or out of like raising that. We're okay. going like so into a dungeon. Question, just to, like of how something actually works. The surprise by which you've gotten this far without much confrontation confrontation is only outmatched by that which you feel seeing the sight awaiting you behind the locked door. A long, sprawling hallway is very dimly lit by the dull glow of electric light, which is far spaced and diminished with age. To the right and left are two doors each, with the second door on both the, light, the left and right be both being double doors. At the far end of the hall is an opening that leads to what looks like a massive room. The air is still intense, seeming to purposefully mimic uh, your apprehension. I'd like to equip my armor in preparation. You put on your leather armor. We have gun ready. You draw your gun. Can I Wait, did you not change into your armor before you left the room? He did not specify that he did. Okay. He may not. So, are we gonna make spot, <laughs> are we gonna make spot hidden rolls to see, to find to inspect the area? Uh, if you want to. Guys. Sure. Yeah, one second. Uh, spot hidden. Here we go. Make sure you use your flashlight. Oh, no! No! Wait, I didn't use my flashlight. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, reroll, reroll. I didn't use my flashlight. Okay, here I turned on my flashlight this one, again. This one with the flashlight. Yeah! I used my flashlight and it actually worked. Just call out a push. Uh, Wait, are you, you know what? I feel like we can... I feel like we should let that happen. Uh, yeah, come on! I forgot to use yeah, my flashlight! Well, oh, there's no perfect. point in me spot hidden at this point. Holy well, crap. Just... So... Yeah, yeah, yeah. good job, no, guys! I just, really control. quick, I just want to mention... Good job, T! Like... I want you to be able to, to improve this skill if you can. Please. I already have it checked. Wait, I have a hard check. check. I can improve it, right? Also, by the way, really quick, I just want to point out good. that I found it hilarious that I had an extreme fail when I wasn't using a flashlight. The moment I did, it was extreme success. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I'm just, just I click. <laughs> I feel like that's why- that's why I said I feel like we should allow that. <sighs> uh, okay, so yeah, any- any- anyone who has not checked their spot hidden and got a hard success or better may. Uh, however, none of you except Fuyu spot anything, and Fuyu, what you spot is that somebody oh. seems to have dropped their wallet down this corridor. <gasps> Money. 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 Money, Mr. Scores. Money's been helping me. Okay. I pick up che the money. Checking the wallet, uh checking the wallet reveals a uh somebody with an ID seems to be a quite handsome young man. Uh and he's foolishly left ten dollars in his wallet. Yeah. Yes. Or why would you keep money in your wallet? I wanna see the ID. Okay, I, I give them the ID and I pocket the money for myself. <laughs> Floyd, <laughs> I'm going to I'm gonna let for you keep the money. Floyd, money. you're taking the ID. You recognize this person. Oh. It, okay. it matches the description that the Lady of the Night gave you of the one guy she had a few feelings for. Oh no. Uh oh. The okay. resemblance yeah. is striking. Is it the same blonde fellow that attacked us? No, it is not. No. All right. 
I'm gonna point- I'm gonna point to this person on the ID and I'm gonna tell the room, unless he attacks you, do not attack him. Because, from what I've heard, he was pushed into this, and we just need to be on our toes. No promises. If he attacks you, you are f- fully allowed to defend yourself. Just do not engage unless provoked. Okay. That is all oh, you find. Uh, although, for you, you have walked uh, nearly halfway down this hall to, to see that. You spotted that from a little while away. Uh, mm-hmm. As you get to the midpoint of this hall, I want you uh, to make me a Listen, roll. All of us. All right. Only for you. Only yeah. for you. Yeah. Actually, uh, oh. Floyd, since you're there <laughs> to grab the ID, you would also be that far into the hallway. <laughs> Shit, you got no. I'm checking my listen. Both of you hear the voices, which, uh, Fu, you recognize as the ones you heard before. They're louder now. You think oh. you, you both can identify where they're coming from. There is an opening at the end of the hall that leads into what looks like a massive room where you can see uh, a few boxes. Uh, You hear voices from that room. Did you say there was doors in the hallway? Yes, but at the end of the hallway is an opening into what looks like a big room with boxes. Can we check the doors? You can. (laughs) Nobody has tried yet. Um, there, there are two doors on either side of the hallway. Uh, I'll check one. I'll check one. Uh, the the second door on both the left and right are double doors. I'm going to check one of the doors. Which one? I want to oh, check wow. the one. O- oh, okay. You want to check the one on the left? Uh, first or uh, second door on the left or right? I was going to check the first one on the left. Okay, okay, first one on the left. I get to open my map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. Om nom nom nom. Oh, Floyd, you're gonna like this room. This room is more brightly lit than you might have expected, given the lighting the entrance hallway greeted you with. This room is stocked haphazardly with various chemicals and medications, surgical tools, equipment, and other miscellaneous medical equipment. There is a considerable amount of white powders on the table in the center of the room. Okay. What's most notable about this room is the uncleanly state of the room and equipment. Many tools, and especially the patient's beds, are covered with splotches of dark fluid stains. Oh, God. Millie, hey, Floyd, you might want to check this out. Oh, God. I feel like there might have been experimentation in here. This is not something that a someone with their license or someone in a in a like extreme measure would use if they're trying to keep their patients alive yeah this is this not is a professional looking room some something's going on given the description of this room what do you wish to do oh, so at uh, at Floyd's uh, Floyd's comment of there's definitely something going on Casey is gonna kind of give Floyd a look of yeah, don't fucking <laughs> Like, no shit. No, Sherlock. I mean, I mean experimentation, <laughs> not like something bad. Something more than that. Something more bad. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um. Are you gonna take anything from the room? I'm going to look closer. I'm just curious. Uh, look closer at what? Medication. Probably Check the medication. Not. Uh, pharmacy roll. Ah, that's a pass. Uh, so you surprised. you are able to say to see that a particular there are particularly high amount of stimulant drugs haphazardly stacked in piles of white powder throughout this room. The powder on the table consists of four different types of amphetamines. It would not be a stretch to say that the people down here are using lots of these stimulant drugs. You know that these enhance people's minds and bodies. Alright. They are typically oh. taken in very small doses. This does not look like a small dose. Um, 
Would there be any, like, documents in the room that I can look at? Uh, you can search for some. I'm gonna okay. do that. So while Floyd's doing that, I want to go yes. across the hall and check the first door on the right. Okay. Anybody else doing anything with this room? Uh, Casey would have, uh, Casey is gonna, uh, check the door that is opposite that one. Uh, that's the one Randy's headed to? Okay. Uh, Neon Fuyu? Um, what else is in the room, sorry? Uh, There's two other doors. There are, yeah, so in, in the room, this is a medical room. Uh, it's very brightly lit. Uh, Floyd is rummaging through some papers and has identified a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, uh, amphetamine, uh, drugs all over the tables. Uh, there's quite a lot of it. Uh, there is also, uh, there's a lot of medical equipment, uh, surgical tools, uh, and various prescription medications. You can also see that the room is very uncleanly, with many tools and patient beds uh, covered in splotches of dark fluid stains. I will be right back, but you guys go ahead and explore other rooms if you can. I'll be right back. I guess I'll describe the next room to you while we wait for Floyd to come back and await the result of the papers they're looking for. So, the next room appears to be... Uh, Okay. Even before you enter this room, which is the first door on the right in this hallway, you can hear the age of the power and heat systems before you see it. The light in the room flickers, ironically seeming to be of lower quality than those further from the generator that is the focal point of this room. A large boiler boasts its size in this cramped and fume-filled room. Piles of coal for the boiler and liquid gas containers for the generator sit in opposing piles with the back wall having shelves full of spare parts, repair tools, electric wires, and construction diagrams. Ooh. That sounds Ooh. like something for Casey. Casey is definitely gonna take those building plans. Uh, you take a building plan. Okay. They seem to be plans for constructions of shelves. Uh, there are some repair diagrams for the generator and most of it is other miscellaneous things okay is there anything in there that seems kind of like out of place you can uh, spot like, in if you want I mean like yeah. for the construction <laughs> is there anything like that's kind of weird in, in there uh I would require spot hidden what do I see I'll spot oh, him oh. for her. Ah, ah, that's... I don't that's, see uh, anything. Kaya, you don't see much, but... Rainy, you okay. notice one... Uh, they're, they're in the other room, so I'm describing what they found, and then I'll resolve your action. Uh, Randy, you, uh, Thomas, you spot... Uh, what... In the pile of, kind of, like, the, the orientation of the fuel cans, you notice one that's sectioned off from the rest, a bit too far for you to think that it's not purposeful. Uh, and I will describe it to you. And it has a distinct aroma as you get closer to it that overpowers even the other fumes in this room. Hmm. Hey, Casey, I think I found something over here. Uh, are you investigating okay. it, Casey? Uh, yeah. Uh, Cthulhu Mythos roll. Yeah, I can't do that. Yeah, I guess it's just fuel. Alright. Now I'm gonna push it. Why not? I mean, you're getting closer. Oh dear. Um, I don't know if he wanted to push that. You, you investigating a little bit, uh, a little bit too closely, and suddenly you kind of kick it a bit, and the the can falls over. As soon as the liquid starts spilling out of it, there is a fire. This is a fuel-filled room, with lots of fumes. Oh, great. Um, I just want to point out something that any kind of, like, container containing something like that would be closed. 
Arthur. You you were inspecting it. You opened it to inspect it. Um. There's a fire. Big, how it's, big? It's not big yet, but it's gonna get real big if you don't do something. There's a lot of fuel nearby. In case you have any way to put it out. It is a small fire. You could try to put it out if you are fast. So can someone please try to put it out? In the room. I'm just I'm in the if, other room. I'm just wondering if Casey has anything like you in her possession. Boot. Okay. So hex, what would be we rolling against then? If we're trying uh, to put this out. If you're putting it out before it spreads, Dex. Hmm. Who's got All a high right. dexterity? Casey, what's your dex? Uh, 55. Well, try and put it out. Both of you can try. What sucks is I'm in the other... Okay, good, good Thomas. My dex is 52. So, to- you, 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 see, you see Casey really trying to figure this out, and then some drops of whatever was inside that can spill out onto the floor. And there is immediately fire there. Uh, with oh, your very quick boy. thinking, you rush over with your leather padded boots and stomp on the fire, putting it out quickly before it can spread to the very close by fuel cans. Okay. Okay, Casey, I think we're done with this room. We better go check some other ones. Uh, meanwhile, Floyd is checking for, uh, you said documentation... Document of any of this your choice of accounting or pharmacy got it okay you use the skill i actually have <laughs> yep you you find a, uh, a a few papers uh that detail certain uh prescriptions as they're called but by what they look like these are people being prescribed amphetamine stimulants at far beyond recommended dosage levels. And then, as you keep reading, you come to see something about people being brought in for journeys into their second self. Is there any more information I can see on this, or is that all that it's got, that these documents have given me? It is, it is written as if second self is supposed to be something that the person reading should understand. As uh, it is not explained. Uh, okay. So I'm gonna pocket this. Pocket it. I have reason. What uh, was part of the condition for uh, my detective buddy here? Uh, that you have things that you can basically serve as evidence. Mm hmm. And what's gonna be good evidence? Mm hmm. This type of amphetamine? Yeah. This place gonna get shut down. Hmm. Uh, these are not illegal amphetamines. No, but it's still, you know. Indeed. Vast amounts. And with a C blood type, that's some uh, voodoo shit. Hmm. Anyway, <laughs> is there anything in the, else in the room some. that stands out? Uh, the very weird dark fluid stains all over the place. All right, I will inspect the stains. Uh, Cthulhu Mythos. Well, you are not sure what this is. Huh. Is there Dark. anything I can use in my medical kit to test it? Uh, you could. Uh, it's dried. But can examining I take it. A swab with alcohol on it, extract it from the, st- from the stain, and take it with me. Yes, yes you can. And what do I roll for that? You can just do it. I okay, was like, I'm doing that. I mean, I was saying you could just you should just cut a swath. Yeah, I agree. Watch from well, the, when the it sh- comes we can we could do it like that, but for the best view for a microscope, you actually want to enhance it with alcohol so that you can see it on it see it oh, better okay. on your microscope. All this, right. Yeah, but this is like bullshit. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm I'm saying like, you know, take it take it uh like so that you can do the alcohol thing before like right before you put it under hey, yeah no, i see your point so doesn't, i will cut, that, a, I will cut sl- some of it off doesn't the, that only like doesn't that only apply for like a certain amount of time uh let me look that up 
Uh, you can do something else while I look this up, Hex. Okay. Uh, so Neon is keeping an eye on the on the entranceway. Uh, what was Fuyu doing? Laughing when uh, things started to catch on fire. <laughs> yeah, God. <laughs> you did hey, manage to see that. I what I was doing. <laughs> Um, besides that, uh, is there any, really anything else to check? Uh, there are two more doors down the hall. They are both double doors on the left and right. I was gonna say, mm. technically aren't there four more doors? <laughs> they, they're double doors, so they, they would lead to one room, but there's just two doors there. Hmm. What do the doors look like? They are double doors. They are wooden. Okay, so there's no, like, window or anything? From what I'm seeing, 24 right. to 48 hours might be the limit for that. So I'm gonna keep it, I'm gonna keep it on the thing for right now. Uh, so you've taken a swab of it with the alcohol? I, think I have cut a part of the patch off and I'm putting it in my thing. So that I may use that technique later. Because it okay. might because that you can only do it for a certain amount of time, as uh, Dark has just said. Okay. All right. So. Okay. How, are, is there any other rooms that we haven't inspected yet? Uh, yes. yes. There, there well, is a what, there's double I'm doors like, on the left and right further the moment, down the hall. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna go down one of the one of the double doors further Watch down the hall. I mean, uh, I'll you took le we we took left first, so I'm gonna go right. You go to the right. Is everyone following, or is anybody going into the other one? Yeah, I'm following. I'm following. One. I want to check the other one. All right. I'm gonna follow. Okay, so three of you are going to the right doors. Uh, uh Neon, Neon has said F that door. <laughs> that door. So what are you? What are you doing, buddy? You going with uh, Randy? You're gonna go go with? Well, he, he he said he he said he was watching the. Uh, yeah, he's just the, chilling the in the The way that voices were coming from. Okay. You're going to keep an eye out for the voices. Got you. I'm going to look for day talking and gun ready. Good job. Thank you. All right, so. Okay, I'm going so. Right. right door. On my map is that one. Uh-oh. As you, you open the door to what appears to be a dining room, it is somewhat dusty and the tables appear poorly cleaned. There are still empty food trays, dirty cutlery, used napkins, and crumbs littering the table and floor. At the far end of the of the left wall is the entrance to what seems to be a kitchen. Yeah. Kitchen. Fuyu, you might want to trek in here to make sure they didn't capture her Kermit in trying to serve frog legs or the next day. What? Why would you say that? Kermit! <laughs> <laughs> My gosh. <laughs> what? Damn it! I said that joke earlier. Why would you do this? So this this is the room that you guys are presented with. Uh, what are you doing? Oh, I think Bob's gonna go look in the kitchen. <laughs> See if Kermit's in there. Alright. What are the others you doing? So Kermit. Alright. Uh and <laughs> Thomas, oh, what are you Kermit. doing? Simply Kermit. Oh wait, no, well, Thomas a, isn't in this room. Yeah, uh, yeah I'm a Casey, wall. what is, what is Kaya doing? Casey's just gonna, just gonna kind of. Uh, is Casey just following? Just gonna kind of follow or... Floyd. Okay. All right, so I I guess uh, both of you will be looking around. So you can both make spot hidden rolls for this room. Up, oh, I don't have any. Oh, that's a hard to says. Okay. Oh no. Uh, well, no, really Fuyu important. isn't looking in this room. I, I wanted one from Kai as well, ah. since she was following Floyd around. Oh! Both of you... Both of you immediately spot, uh, although Casey recognizes a little bit more about it, a, a book that seems to be a bit out of place. It is... Book. It is open, as if somebody was in the middle of reading it and didn't bother to pick it up. Uh... Oh. Turning over the cover... Casey immediately realizes that this definitely looks like an occultish book, and it has the title of The Rabbi's Golem. Yeah. Ooh. 
Wait, and Jewish? we are faking that. <laughs> that is, that is <laughs> the next book in our collection. Yep. Right. yep. Definitely taking that. We're taking that. Uh, is this on Casey's inventory? Or Casey's the one who or... touched it. Alright. We'll put it on Apparently. Casey's inventory. So, Rabbi's Golem. Okay. So you have that book. Uh, and Fuyu gets into the kitchen. In almost in a strange juxta- juxtaposition, the kitchen area is curiously nearly spotless compared to the dining area, as if everything was wiped down very recently. A strong sense of uh, scent- stench of ammonia is present in the room, and no clutter upon the cooking appliance- appliances except for one pot on the stove is are present. Appliances. <laughs> Appliances. Appliance. <laughs> can you hear? Can we, can we listen to see? Can she listen to see if she hears Kermit now? Yeah, Fu, you can make a listen roll. Make a listen roll, please. Okay. Please find, please find Kermit. That's an extreme <laughs> success. <laughs> Wait, someone's having a strike. What the? You, you, <laughs> you trying to ribbit? You yeah. You hear? You hear a ribbit. Coming from a large metal door that is in this kitchen room. Run to him! Run to him! It is Kermit. Cut! I I inspect the thing. You open the door. <laughs> you see a frog hopping out of the of the thing, and you recognize the wart on the hind legs. It is Kermit. Kermit. <laughs> What you also see is a clearly dying person on a meat hook inside the freezer. Uh, Inspect uh, provoking a sanity oh! check. Does anyone want to inspect oh, a dying great. guy? Because yeah, I can't be a, asked. It is a thing. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, the, luck roll, more important. the luck roll has been repurposed. Where you must I make die. a sanity... Fuyu, you have seen a dying person on a meat hook. You must have a sanity check. That is a failure. You are going to lose one D. Uh, one D four sanity. Call to, you can call the void if you need, man. I mean, I don't really care about the dying guy. I'm just more happy that Kermit's alive. <laughs> you take when you, are you take alive. three points of sanity loss. Yeah, you might want to call for it is, uh, to come and it, it is what? not pleasant. <laughs> what? <laughs> we got a corpse! Also, Kermit's here. Are you that's screaming that? No, oh, oh, that's not a... Yeah, no, nah, I, I, I go to Floyd. I okay. Go, I calmly tap their not shoulder. Yeah, Yo, there's a dying guy, but more importantly, I found Kermit! <laughs> oh, boy. And I'm gonna grab my med kit and just walk into the kitchen. Uh, first aid roll. Hold on, I gotta read. I gotta find. Or actually, or actually, no. You're seeing this, so you need a sanity check as well. Well, if if. Oh, uh, or wait, no, no, me. no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, you're right. I'm getting ahead of myself. You're right. You don't First need one. First aid. I'm clicking it. I clicked it. Extreme success. Uh. Yeah. Uh, Casey's you... gonna. Casey's also gonna follow as well. Mm-hmm. So. You managed to. You managed to get him off the meat hook. Uh. But as you do, you joke. you recognize immediately at a glance this man is gone. Well, that was that led nowhere. I'm <laughs> the, sorry, I just the, made us. The, just... the, the, the first the first aid was to be able to tell that he was very dead. He was pretty much like dead. Dead. Well, do I recognize who it is? No, you do not recognize this person. Good. Also, can I make the stupid joke I came up with? Although you can check your first aid. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Floyd plays Dead by Daylight. Okay, so uh, I recognize that the guy is dead. Can I see if there's anything identifying or helpful that I can find on the person? Uh, no. He is he is naked. Oh my god. That would that that's why for you got the sanity check. Oh god, I can see him. <laughs> Yeah, no. If, right. if if we were if we weren't using sanity checks, I would have ate that corpse because uh, it would be wasteful. <laughs> All right. So, casual. casual. Meanwhile, 
Meanwhile, uh, yeah, let's go to Thomas. Meanwhile, for a Thomas enters the next door. Uh huh. Uh, and this room is do, 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 document. We learn the secrets from your fr frog. What does he say? <laughs> okay, I speak to Kermit to learn the secret, and Kermit <laughs> simply says, "Ribbit." <laughs> <laughs> This room. Come on. There isn't. There it is. This room is less illuminated than one might expect. A room that you immediately recognize to be a library, uh, oh. with copious amounts of reading to be done, should be. Uh, though there are a few tables with desk lamps for those who wish to remedy it. You find it a bit strange just how stingy the cult seems to be with illumination down here, considering how many resources this place clearly took to create. Even if the light does no favors to its presentation, it is impressive how voluminous and stocked this library is, considering its small floor space. I want to go to the library room. <laughs> you, you get you, the you psychic go... ding in your head that the library has been opened! Oh my god. <laughs> you make your way over. Yeah, you... <laughs> but, uh, uh, unless Thomas passes, like, all of his actions, he gets to act first. I want to go over and look at the desk. Luck. Luck? Oh, alright. Wait, who- well, I gave the idea, but- <laughs> Alright, you've passed. Describe to me what kind of notebook you find. Uh... <laughs> I, did, I don't have anything prepared for this, but I want to give you a spotlight. This isn't my idea. Just grab it, just grab it. Yeah, but uh, I gotta... Okay. Trust me, just grab it. Okay, I'll grab it and, uh... I guess I'll just leave Floyd you, you, up to you, what you, it is. You, okay. You find a notebook that is written by a certain A.E. Uh, which is introductions to the wondrous world of the occult. It is a right. hand. It is a handwritten novella of some, perhaps, sixty pages. All right. Hmm. Well, it doesn't you think, sound like. You think hmm? if you read this, you might be able to gain a check to your occult skill? All right. Sure. Would I be able to gain anything from it? Yeah, me. Uh. This is, uh, this is kind of a cult for dummies 101. I kind of figured, but thought I'd ask. <laughs> anyway. So, I imagine by now Floyd and Dark have finished their escapades in the, um, uh, the kitchen. The cannibal <laughs> kitchen? Yeah. <laughs> the cannibal Imagine and frog cuisine kitchen. <laughs> Fui, you have not lost that much sanity. <laughs> I don't need to lose sanity. That's my <laughs> MR. Can I eat it? <laughs> okay, so library no. use, library no. use roll. What? Uh, yes. Everybody, oh. click on library. If you if you want to. Oh no! I want to push that. What are you doing to push it? Wait, what, what are we doing? Use Sorry? my flashlight. We were trying to use the I still didn't hurt any of the library useful. I just see it. Okay. That's not even here. I mean, I guess he could have went in there if he wanted to. Can we just have Don's library use work? <laughs> oh, wait, Don, you went inside the room? Oh, if we're in the room, no, I didn't. Okay. Damn it. We find nothing. All right, that's uh. Except my ex. No, I'm going to. I'm going to. Uh, Break hang on, her. brain not working. Uh oh. Uh, okay. You want spot hidden? Yeah. If I can't see anything library wise, I'm gonna see if spot hidden do any better. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> spot. Uh, you see an etching in one of the bookshelves. Uh, okay. what does it say? It says, This knowledge blessed by the one who dwells below. Wait, you... we've heard that phrase before, haven't we? We've heard that phrase before. 
Have you? We've heard that phrase before. The uh, Cthulhu Mythos? Yes. <laughs> Ooh, Did you roll nice. a success? Very nice. very nice. Yeah, I rolled a success on a really hard roll. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my god, my mom just said it's about to You see time. me, mom? <laughs> My mom literally, just, now, said, mom. My mom literally just said, it's about damn time. You know that the one who dwells below is one who is fabled to, is a certain being that is fabled to dwell within the deepest caves that have seemingly no exit and endless caverns. It calls to people in their sleep to serve uh, them, and sometimes uh, it is fabled to have sent some servants to the upper world? That's about as much as you know about it. It came up a little bit in Clithonus' writings. Oh, but I hate that I can't check that. Nope. Cthulhu Mythos, uh, you do not magically gain more Mythos knowledge. <laughs> or do you? But <laughs> the fact that I, I made that, I feel I like... I use my, like, occult skill? Uh, yeah, you can. Can we just... I, I can't believe I made that. Good job, Fluff. I will come in there and kick your ass. You see, you, you <laughs> paid with all those hor horrible rolls, and there you go. Uh, there are some there are some mythical beings, such as minotaurs, or things that dr uh, are minotaurs? Below... <laughs> <laughs> there, there, there are some are they minors? Minotaurs. Is that why you're standing like that? What? <laughs> There, there are hey, fabled no, no. beasts that dwell below in in strange uh, places, I, I but none by that name. Minotaur. Okay. Hey, I can you yeah, yeah. Minotaur. You... They have pickaxes. Hex, can you pause the recording for a second? Uh, not for now. Uh, All right. If everyone has to do it. next week, then. Yeah, we can do this next week. Ah. Good. Later, guys. Good. Thanks for having me.